The crack. Not, not just drugs, but I understand what the brother was saying. The brother was saying, hey, we got a problem here, and we being punished because people is not being obedient. Right. Now, he said, people are being, the people is not being obedient, but y'all are being obedient. I'm seeing right. some brothers standing around but, here and gotcha, sisters gotcha. being obedient. Yes, sir. So, y'all are being obedient by doing his will. So, right. how can this community, this group here is a community. Right. How can this community come up so we can start showing other people hey, the right you. way? Gotcha. That's all the matter. Okay, I'm gonna show you this, but it's not just go. I'm gonna go step by step with you. Okay, so be patient with me as I bring it out because I'm gonna touch on the first thing that you brought out, which is drugs, uh, uh, crack, cocaine, weed, whatever it may be, a substance that distorts our mind. All right, on us being sober and thinking right and doing right and living right for God. Right. Read this because one thing we don't do and one thing that we hide and we scared when it comes to our own people is telling the truth. You understand? We scared to tell the truth because we think we are being what? Snitching. Okay? But I'm going to show you what the Bible says about telling the truth. All right? Not hiding sin. You understand? Because most of our people in sin. Most of our people are in sin. You got a handful of our people, which is us out here that's keeping God's commandments. All right? Y'all are learning the commandments. All right? Read. Leviticus chapter 5, verse 1. And if a soul sin and hear the voice of swearing. So it says, if a soul sin. So if you, any of you brothers and sisters right here, if you've heard of, if you know, Anything about anything going on in this neighborhood that involves sin, selling drugs to your people, distorting your mind, alcoholism is sin. Okay? Read. And if they so sin and hear the voice of swearing and is a witness whether he had seen or known of it. So if Lil Ray Ray came and told your, your grandmother and then your grandmother told you, the, the word traveled, but it got to you. What are you supposed to do? Read. If he do not utter it. If he what? Do not utter it. The Bible says you have to utter that. Who do you utter that to? Who do you utter the sin of somebody selling crack, cocaine, weed, methamphetamines, whatever the hell you call these things, these drugs to our people? Who do you tell? You should tell people who want to make a difference. Okay, who are those people that's in place today to make that difference? I think right now the church should be. That's that's good. That's that's very important you said that because we right here are the vanguards and the church that's in Acts 7 and 35. Okay, we are the church that was in the wilderness with Moses. Right. You understand? I got you. So we have to come back to our rightful mindset first. As the officer said, repent. Because repenting starts in the mind. And then you application of the scriptures start to apply the commandments. Right. Then you can teach others right from wrong. Right. Do's and don'ts. Right. Okay? Right. So it said you have to go and do what? If he do not utter it, then so it said you have to utter this. Utter this. Right. Who you gonna utter it to? The distributors of that said drugs and amphetamines and so forth and so forth. No, sir. You're not going to go to a drug dealer. And no, 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 no. The administration, you know, the people, uh, the pharmacy, those that make no. you. No, you're going to tell the church, you're going to tell the people who's trying to make a difference. I agree with I that. You. I, but, you, brother, I, I got you. You answer my question. But hold on, hold on. But you're going to go to the authorities. Right. That's the thing that you're missing. The, the powers that be is of God. He set up order and structure. The right? Government. Government. The government. Yeah, government. Right. 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 And our job, if we see or hear of drugs being sold in our community, right. sisters getting taken and put on prostitution, all right, taken to different countries, right. all right, human we have to, yeah. human trafficking, right, we have to other these things to who? The police, right. the powers that be. Right. But we are scared to do that because you're scared of Lil Ray Ray with his guns. You're scared of the backlash or the hood coming against you. But I'm not I, saying you particularly, but, no, but, but that's what the mindset of our people are. But, but I understand what you're 
Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? And I think if we come together as brothers and sisters who care, uh -huh. and we're trying to make a difference, right. I think we can overcome these powers. We by, can. We can take over by, by buying stores, by buying a That's right. That's right. It. Yeah, we can go tell the police, but if we got some police who are not doing nothing. That's and, true. And, but but yeah. we got some police who do care. There you so go. So we need to find out who these people are and bring them into your fold. But brother, I got you. What you're saying. All right. I, I got another one for you. Go to uh, Jose. No, is there four? Because it just don't stop there, my brother. What's uh, your name? I'm Drew. I, Drew, Drew. Brother Drew. It just don't stop I with understand. the drugs, brother Drew. I understand. It starts. It stops with the drugs. It stops with the prostitution. It stops with a plethora of things. But, and, the, and the next thing it stops with is us killing each other. Right. Because uh, the George Floyd, the uh, Trayvon Martin, yeah. the the uh, uh, Mike Brown. Breonna Taylor, Mike Brown, all these instances are a small. Uh, Spectic, spectacle in everything else that's going on in our community. But we are killing each other are. at a higher alarming rate well, than the than the police, I than agree. the so-called white man, Esau. All right? Hold on. Hold on, I'm gonna read that. Read Hosea chapter four, verse Just four. pay attention, sister. Just pay attention. Hear the word of the Lord, ye children of Israel. So every time you go here in this Bible, he's talking to Israel. All right? right. right. He's talking to us, his right. people. Read. But the Lord hath a country. Hey, sister, come on back to the front. Sister, sister. Hey, my brother. Hey, y'all just stop dealing hey. with him. Sister, you we need that? you back in the front. This is what we're dealing with you at. Come back to the front. Okay. Hey, bro. I got what you said. Hosea chapter 4, verse 1. Brother Drew, why you going, bro? I'm, I'm showing you something. See, okay. this right here is what's the problem with our neighborhood. I got you. I got you. Go ahead. This is when we have to correct and fix. Go ahead. Go ahead. Read. Hear the word of the Lord, ye children of Israel. For the Lord hath a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. The controversy is with us, Israel. Because we're rebellious. Because we don't want to follow God's word. That's why he put us in captivity. That captivity won't turn until Christ come back. Let's go hunt us. Right. Wherever you go on this earth, whether it's uh, uh, Europe, Asia, wherever you go, the curses are going to cleave to you because we were disobedient. And, and, and okay? some of us are still being disobedient. No, all of us. Most of us are still being disobedient. So are, are you saying y'all being disobedient? No, sir, I'm That's not. What I'm I said most of us. Okay. Most of our people celebrated what? Yesterday. Yesterday? Yeah. New Year's. Most of our people the week before celebrated what? Christmas. Christmas. Why? Because... That's the sin they in because those are the things they've been taught. But can they make sense of these things? No, because it's not in the Bible. That's right. These are lies and philosophies that you were fed through captivity and hard burned and slavery. And I agree with right. you. Okay? I agree with you. Right. But what you're saying and the things that we are celebrating as pagans, right. these things are not worth it. That's right. And, 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 and it's being disobedient right. to that will. To the most high. And, and I think y'all I agree with what you're yes, saying. Yes, sir. Let me, and, and okay. Let me finish this. Because this is the second part of the drugs, is us killing each other. All right? Read. Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God in the land. There's no truth in the land because we don't tell the truth. We don't want to so called so -call rat our brothers out when they destroying our people, when they're selling drugs and uh, witchcraft to our people. You understand? Know Read. Verse 2 By swearing. And lying, and killing, and stealing. It said by killing, by stealing. Who do we rob, Brother Drew? Do we go to River Oaks and rob the, the so-called white man? Bring it on. No, we rob our brother and sister right. that stay next door to us. I agree. And we ain't got no agree. money. Yeah. We know they ain't got no money, but I'm going to break in their house, and they go to work and work hard for whatever they got to steal their TV. And, and to I steal mean, the things that they have. And, right. We hate each other, Brother Drew. But it's no it's love, love within but, our community. But y'all are showing love. Yes, sir, we are. What are doing. Yes, sir. And I think y'all are embracing something that needs to be heard. The and Bible. Important. That's what we're and embracing. I think we need to keep our heritage. I hope y'all continue to grow. I'll but pray. I think the message, though, again, uh -huh. we need to take another step further. And I give, I give you my card, and we can talk further later on. But my thing is this. I think we need to start rebuilding our communities with the same thing that you teach, uh -huh. I think is important. Because if we don't start rebuilding our communities with teaching obedience to the word of God, right. respecting the word of God, uh -huh. 
respecting one another. Mm -hmm. We don't have a community. One right. thing we need to start doing, if we have to start like y'all doing in a group and grow, grow, till we start getting more and more people understanding what we need to be doing. I understand your message. Gotcha. I'm gonna give you my card. I'm just, where do y'all meet at? Where do y'all meet at? All of our information is on the back of their flyer. Gotcha. Gotcha. All our information, brother Drew. You, brother. All right. I, I, yes, sir. I, I and and what you're saying is, it starts with us. What we're doing is what Christ did. And I you agree. know what I'm saying? And, I agree. and it starts with uh, setting up, as Ezekiel say, little sanctuaries. It does. Okay. I agree. And, but we all have to be go to First Corinthians one and ten. We all have to be on one accord. Right. You can't have like the Christian church. You got the Methodists, as Austin said, Episcopalians, the Mormons, Jehovah's Witness. They all have different doctrines. You know what I'm saying? They all believe different things. And I agree. Okay? But we can't come together unless we're under the banner of the Most High God. Right. Okay? And, and I agree. You got it? So that's the first step. Okay? Right. Read that. First Corinthians chapter 1, verse 10. Bring it up. Now I beseech you, brethren, by the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, uh -huh. that ye all speak the same Thing. Right. So that we all speak the same thing. I agree. Thing. And, okay. and, and that's so, what we have to speak the that's same right. thing that's in right. order to get there. I'm, you know, brother, I, I, like I said, I just wanted to hear what y'all Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I got you, brother Drew. I got what you. Are doing is all good. praises. I know me, myself. Uh -huh. I've been places. I've seen things. And I said, you know what? I got to step back and make a difference. I have to be obedient to right. him. And the only way I can do the things that I'm doing is being obedient. So, that's right. And of course, like some of the things I just mentioned, I took a stand and say, I want to make a difference in our community. That's right. I build houses and apartments. Okay. I build, I, I, I build halfway houses for people. Right, right. And I've done these things That's right. 20 years. That's the help to make a difference. That's right. To make I got a difference. you. Yeah. And we need that more. That's so right. I, I believe what you're saying. I just want to hear it. Got Thank you, you, got brother. you. Yes, sir. Check us out, brother Drew. I will. I will. Read it. Now I beseech you, brethren, by the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, that ye all speak the same thing. So we all must speak the same thing. Right. How does this process start? Go to uh, hold it, Second Ezra, fourteen to thirty-four. It all starts in your mind, meaning the process of repenting. You understand what I'm saying, brother? You was out here last time, right? All right, and you have to understand that you have to start making and taking steps to change. All right, all this could be to you. As a lovely song, as Ezekiel say. Read this first and we go get Ezekiel because the most high God is about action. What's your name? Wally. Wally? Wally? Yeah, okay, Brother Wally. The most high God is about action. Okay? You was out here last time we was out here. Okay? And that's a good thing that you you know of us, you follow us, but the most high don't wanna he don't want somebody on the sidelines. Right. He wants somebody in the fight. That's right. You understand what I'm saying? You know how the people at the football, they got you got they got the bench squad. He don't want somebody on the bench. He wants somebody on the field. That's you understand right. what I'm saying? We on the field. We out here fighting. We at war right now. That's spiritual right. war. All right? Because you got the sister that was here, right? In her mind, through the through the things that she been taught, she think it's okay to be the way she is. Baby, you understand? Sister, sister, we don't care. We don't care. We are here teaching the word of God. You are disrespecting the word of God. You understand? You don't love God. You hate God right now. That's right. Because you're disturbing God's word. Do you understand? Right. You you don't have knowledge of the truth. We're trying to feed you with that knowledge. That's right. But you've been rebellious as our children, the most high God's children, have been. That's why we're in the state we're in today. Right. Read. Second Ezra chapter 14, verse 34. Bring it up. Therefore, if if so be that ye will subdue your own understanding. Listen, sister. It says subdue. Subdue. All you men over there need to subdue your own understanding. Right. I have one request. You don't know God. I have one request, baby. You don't have a request. That's right. My request is you repent That's and keep right. the commandments. Bring it up. Are God going to bring judgment upon you? Right. You, are you don't want God's right judgment. Now. You are judging me right now. My Thank job you. is to judge you. That's right. Give me Corinthians. Bring it up. Bring it up. It is 2nd uh, Corinthians. I'm going to laugh at all y'all in a minute. Give me that. Because you in Christianity think that you're not supposed to be judged. That nobody's supposed to tell you right from wrong. When you see sin, as we just read in Leviticus 5 and 1, you got to say something. 
Go ahead, Chief. Go ahead, Chief. Go ahead, Chief. Go ahead, Chief. Our job is to correct ye. Right. Okay, read. First Corinthians chapter 6, verse 2. Bring it Do up. ye not know that the saints, the saints, who are the saints? We are the saints. That's right. Let's prove that. Bring it up. We are the saints of God. Okay, Psalms 148. 148. We are the saints. Don't get it twisted. John Osteen ain't no saint. Right. You understand? He's deceiving your mind. Right. Okay? He got you under a spell. Bring it out. Thinking that everybody created equal. Right. Thinking that we all the same. Why are we in the slums and ghettos? Why are we the first fire, last hire? Bring it out. Okay? Read. Psalms chapter 148, verse 14. Bring it out. He also exalted the horn of his people. He exalted the horn of his people. The horn, who is that Christ? Who is that our leader? Who is that the, the man that's coming in an angelical form to save his people? Right. To redeem his people. Don't, under, don't, don't think that all is lost. Don't think that everything is, is forgotten. Okay? Just like we was in Egypt for 400 years, we've been here how long? 400 years. The most I redeemed us out of Egypt, he gonna redeem us out of Babylon. That's right. You better wake up, read. He also exhorted the horn of his people, the praise of all his saints, even of the children of Israel. Indeed, the children of Israel are the saints of God. Right. You better understand and recognize who the saints are, who God's chosen people are. Bring it up. Why are we being destroyed and brought to a lower state? Right. We got the answers for you. Right. All right? You got to come out of the mindset of hating your own brothers. Right. Go back. First Corinthians chapter 6, verse 2. Bring it up. Do ye not know that the saints, the saints, the Israelites, the men of God, the prophets that you see right here before you across the street. Right. right. It's time to wake up. The saints gonna do what? Shall judge. Shall what? Judge. Judge, sister. We shall judge. Judge what? The world. We're gonna judge the world. That's right. Boy, let's show them who the world is. Isaiah 45, 17. We're gonna judge the world. What world are we gonna judge? What world are we gonna set right to get the right understanding? To tell them you in the midst of sin. Okay? Read that. Isaiah chapter 45, verse 17. Bring it up. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord. Israel shall be saved in the Lord. It didn't say no other nation right there. It's 18 nations in this Bible, and it didn't it didn't mention none of them. It said Israel shall be saved. But that Israel, those Israel that shall be saved. Is those that's keeping the commandments, my brother. Right. right. Those that's following the will of God. And you done heard brothers say that and sisters say that today. The will of God, the will of God. What is the will of God? Give me, give, give me that. Psalms 40 and what is it? Eight. That's right. Our customs that we're supposed to dress as. Right. Mindset that we're supposed to build our our people up from the slums to the royalty to that reach. That's right. Right here. Yes, sir. That's right. Read that. Psalms chapter 40, verse 8. Bring it up. I delight to do thy will. I delight to do thy will. Listen up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All y'all that say you believe in God, what are you doing for God? How are you showing love to God, the creator of heaven and earth? The one that put the spirit in your body. How are you showing love to God? How you doing, sister? Good. Check out this sign right here and see if you own that. See if your father is on that sign. Your biological father. If he comes for any of those tribes. Read. Psalm chapter 40, verse 8. I delight to do thy will, O oh my God. Yea, thy law is within my heart. The law. The law is within your heart, your mind. Your mind is on the most high right. to do his will, to not be buying and selling on the Sabbath, right. to not be smoking cigarettes, right. to not be defiling your temple. Right. 
and transgressing the laws today. Bring it on. That's what should be in your mind. Not selling drugs to your brothers. Right. Destroying their mind. Right. Selling the witchcraft to your brothers. Right. Killing your brothers. Right. This is the mindset of our destroyed people. Because we hate each other. Right. But we got a bigger enemy. But you're not aware or even take knowledge or even want to hear who the enemy is. Bring it up. Read. Isaiah chapter 45, verse 17. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord with an everlasting salvation. With an everlasting salvation. Salvation is only for Israel. Right. We have that, um, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? We have the door open to us. Right. Okay? Because we can choose to not open that door, not walk inside that door, because Christ is the door right. when you read in John 10. All right, we can choose not to even access that door, which most of our people choose that. Right. They choose to not listen to the prophets that are not here today. All right, go to hold it. Go to uh, First Thessalonians. Is it first or second? Five and eight, or four and eight? Second. Second. Our people despise God. They don't want to hear God's word. They don't want to hear. Do what God says, not what your flesh says. Right. They don't want to hear that. They get mad at us, but you're not getting mad at us. Am I telling you my words? What am I reading out of? The Bible. That's right. What am I guiding you from? The Bible. That's right. What am I judging you from? The Bible. Bring it up. Read. First Thessalonians chapter 4, verse 8. Bring it up. He therefore that despiseth, despiseth not man. You don't despise us. You don't despise the prophets. You don't hate us. You hate God. But God, who had also given unto us his Holy Spirit. The most I gave us his Holy Spirit because he poured that out upon the prophets. He gave us through the prophets to leave us this our history. Right. Our historical records of our history, our uh what's the word? Our history, our black history is okay. in the Bible. Okay. This is our history book. But we failed to open our history books. Right. All right. How y'all sisters doing today? We are here sharing the gospel of the good news to you, sisters. Okay. All right. Yeah, come on up. Austin the ride. You can come back. What's your question, sir? We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how we're men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.